welcome. My name is Jennifer Miller, also known as Amethyst Switchers, and I'm playing with my makeup as I do this. So sorry. <laughs> um, I am an author, I am a mother, co-parenting, and I am a makeup lover. This video, most of my videos are makeup oriented, but this video is not an exception, not an exception. This is my review of my Shop My Stash from the last couple weeks. I've been so enjoying doing this. I've, I can't tell you. Uh, I don't know, it makes my heart sing a little. It's just kind of weird, but I enjoy doing it. So we're gonna get straight to it because it's kind of light for me. And I didn't go bad. So we're just gonna go straight, straight into it. Straight, straight, straight into it. You know, uh -uh. straight into it. So, okay, I have two items, two items, at least one, at least one, one item that is not part of this because I ended up using it like instantly. Evidently, there wasn't much left. So you'll see that in an empties video coming up soon. But, um, yeah, and I'll give you a review then. Now, okay. I'm just like trying to choose. My apologies. I'm looking at everything going, which one, which one, which one? Let's start with face. This is not the concealer I thought it was. <laughs> I have two e.l.f. concealers. Okay, they're both the cheaper ones, the, not the $5 one, but this is the $2 one. It, mm, this is part of my, um, my $10 series. It's a full face for $10 look type of thing. And, um... Yeah, no, I won't remember to link it, but it, it's my very first video if you want to go back and look for it. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it, it's, you know, it's okay. It, it's almost empty anyway, but it just is not very pigmented at all. It's not very heavy coverage. It's light to medium. So, I mean, yeah, eh, what you going to do? It's ten, $2. So, what you going to do? <laughs> All right, sorry. Moving on. Oh, no, 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 no. oh, okay. My bronzer, Topshop bronzer. I gave a review at the end of the year for this. Anyway, um, I still like it. Still think it's gorgeous. Blends like a dream. It's just gorgeous. I really am impressed with this. My Elizabeth Arden blushers. Same. They they blend gorgeously. I've used both of them. Um, I went light-handed with this this darker shade. It is in the color. Yeah. Uh huh. Romance rose. And it's very pretty. It isn't extremely as bright as it looks, but this one is just a perfect shade for me. This pink shade here is just a really soft look, and when I'm not wanting to go really ham and, you know, do a ah look, this just is gorgeous. So, yeah, these, these, are, these are good. Elizabeth Arden. Not many people talk about her. Um, Laura from Gold Star Work uses her mascara. I love her mascara. I've used her mascara. I finally had a declutter. I want it back. That's all I'm saying. Breaks my heart. This is in a video and it broke and I was so sad. Oh, I was like heartbroken. But this is my um, Ofra highlighter. <laughs> I have to get another one. I don't even know if I can. It was part of the Smith and March line. What can I say? It's not for highlighter. Everybody loves over highlighters. No exception. None. So, eyes. Let's start with shadows. Let's start. Let's go from good to bad. So, really, there was only one bad. And it's just because 
it is a softer color. If you look at it, it's a softer color. It is in the color Bloom. This is an Ulta Beauty shadow. And honestly, I can't say I'm disappointed with it. I'm not. I just, from the looks out of it, I expected it to be a little more pigmented. But it is extremely soft. So I don't know why I thought it was going to be much darker. I think you can build it up to a nice shade. But I used where I used it, it just kind of dissipated. But honestly, I'm not disappointed. And I will continue to use it. This for, I think this is $3. For $3, this, there is, I'm just holding it like a professional here. <laughs> this e.l.f. Um, quad, just gorgeous. Every color is pigmented, beautifully pigmented. I did my quads before, and I, I um, swatched these. So um, my quad collection, I should say. So I'm not going to re-swatch them, but it is, and I, I said then too that I love them. So yeah, we're just not going to waste time with stuff that has already been said. All right. Now, this is a tough decision. All four of these, I have four left. They're all four just beautiful. I wore this in a look and it's just stunning. This is a ColourPop show. In the color that you're not going to find out because I don't know. <laughs> and see, it's just beautiful. It made such a gorgeous spot of, yeah, beautiful. And they're going, you're nuts. I am. You know what? I never did do this, but this would have made a gorgeous combination. This um, still a magnificent metal, and I can read this one though. I might be able to read this one. Freedom and gorgeous turquoise, gorgeous. And this Sephora topper, it's a it's a shimmer. Oh, oh no! God darn it! Well, that's fun. Ah, uh, it's not under my nails. It really is pretty. It really is pretty. I'm going to put it to the other side. Look at that. Look at that. I wish I would have used that alone on a look, but I never did. I just, I love, I just, I can't get enough shadows. But this is in the color... It says colorful, but I don't think that's... Oh, no. Um, Girls Night Out. That's right. Girls Night Out. And last but not least, this is a ColourPop pigment. This is part of the Kathleen Lights Zodiac pigment collection. And this is, I believe... Uh, The Ram. Freaking, these are pigments. These are gorgeous pigments. I love the turquoise one. I think I misplaced it. It breaks my heart because it was the water bearer and it was my sign. And I'm just like, a year dummy. I hope it will turn up. It's gotta turn up. I don't, I haven't taken it from this house. It's got to turn up. It's just misplaced. Oh, hope so. So, I didn't pull one this shop my stash because I forgot, but <clears throat> welcome to my life. Next shop my stash, I want to pull one. I'm trying to pull one until I use them all. At least once. Okay, eyeliners. I think I did. I did. I forgot and put the um, eyeliner I pulled out for uh, my liquid liner away. Um, that was my NYC liner. It is more of a pot liner than a, a felt tip. 
it's okay. It just takes a steady hand, and I don't have a steady hand. I think I the, the like six times I used it, once did I not get it elsewhere, and I was like, Ugh. every time I'm I kept getting it elsewhere, and I'm like, are you kidding me? <laughs> every time, yeah, without fail. So it was decent. Um, it was good, but it like I said. If you, unless you have a steady hand, and I think a lot of people do, I'm just, I don't, <laughs> so, but it's really a good eyeliner, and it, you can get, I think, if you do have that steady hand, you can get a good wink. I'm going to practice wings this year, I promise you I will. <laughs> okay, the It Brown um, No Tug Eyeliner. I've talked about this before. Oh, and real quick about my look. I apologize. I've had this on since it is now 8 o'clock at night. I've had this on since 4? Yeah, 4. So, 16 hours. <sighs> um, I just kind of freshened it up just a tad just for the video, but I, it's been a long day and I didn't want to take another half hour to do more makeup. I know it's a beauty channel. I'm supposed to be. I apologize. I apologize. <sighs> That's all I can say. But I touched it up a bit. <laughs> but it still doesn't look too bad. About the liner. I don't hate it. It just doesn't show up very well on my waterline. And that's where I use these majority of the time vast majority of the time. I'd say 99% of the time I use it. So once out of 100, I don't, it's not really, you know, worth it. It's not going to show up. The Mali uh, in Royal Plum. Yes. Love it. Love Mali liners. Cargo. Yes. Love it. <laughs> it's definitely a, a repurchase once it's gone. Thinking it's not going to happen soon. Okay. This for... It's an Ulta liner. These are not great. But these are not bad. That took about three swipes up and down to get it that pigmented. It's a little more difficult in the eye. I would like a little more creamy formula. But not too terribly creamy. It's almost there. But when you're trying to get it on your waterline, and it's such a delicate area to get it into your waterline, you're not wanting to sit there and, you know, that's why the name No Tug is so appealing. I have not troops. Great. Just smacked myself in the eye with it. Nice. <laughs> I have not tried the black, but the purple is, the, or the Royal Plum, really, yeah, same, Mally. Uh -huh. The Royal Plum is a really good color and um, shows up really good. But this brown, for some reason, just does not. I don't know. It's a really nice natural one, though, when you like the natural look. But, and mascara and powder. I've been telling you, I've been using my uh, mascara, trying to get rid of it. Actually, I'm going to have to just throw one of them away. I just pulled out. Yeah, it's dried up. It's been a long time, way past what it should be. So I should just toss it. It's sad, but it is what it is. But, <coughs> oh, the lip products. I left them. I kind of put them all away. Oops. They were good. They were good. I don't think... I don't think I had any... Any complaints about any of them. I think they were all just perfect. I love my lip products. There's a few that are in colors that I don't like. And there's a few that have dried up. That's life. That's what happens. But, you know... Excuse me, like I said, I'm at the end of my night. I gotta be up in oh, do, 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 seven hours. <coughs> I can sleep in for eight, but I still gotta export this video. <laughs> so, 
I hope you guys have a great day. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you like these little reviews. Um, I enjoy doing them. I'm sorry I haven't done one in several months. I have not done one in several months, but they're going to start being on the Fridays. They're all following the Thursdays of my shop mustaches, provided I can remember. But thank you so much for watching. You guys are amazing. I love all of you. I am having so much fun doing all my videos. Um, please give this video a thumbs up, click the notification bell, comment down below, and um, subscribe. That would be nice too. Yeah, I know. Memory fuzzy. <laughs> it's all good. I love you all. Thank you so much for watching. And yeah, that's it for tonight. I will see you in my next video. Bye.